y'all hey what's up what's up today is day two in the country of course i'm on a passenger side of my husband we are headed to go and get breakfast y'all thanksgiving was lit we had so much fun um i think in the last clip that y'all saw um my cousins myself and my husband we were playing um spoons or something like that they was playing i wasn't playing because i didn't understand it it was cheating <laughs> because i had drinks in my hand already <laughs> and i didn't want to waste my drink you can't waste your yak so i had a yak in my one hand and a cars in the other hand who problem was that Man. he knew he was supposed to focus on the damn cars I so on my yak i wasn't gonna waste it it's not a spoon in the deck in the in the middle for everybody it's one less spoon for everybody like if it's four of us it's three spoons in the middle so when somebody you know like i said when somebody get their match and pick up a spoon your ass better pick up a spoon too because if you don't you're gonna be drinking and guess who's drinking i had to drink three times and i stopped playing it was a little see how he stopped playing it was fun though like my mama and my aunties and them was on the other table playing um pity pad and every time they saw us diving for a damn spoon they was like what the hell are they doing over there <laughs> it was so fun it was fun we really had a good time though we had a nice little spread we ate we talked we laughed we ate more we ate some more <laughs> they was watching a football game y'all it was real nice nothing like spending time with family y'all know we don't live here so Anytime we come up here and can enjoy them is the time. Today the Dolphins play. And you know it. We're going to be watching it, playing dominoes, drinking again. So it's another situation, of course. Right now, babe and I are going to get some breakfast. Got to make sure I feed this man before he start drinking. Mm -hmm. I'm, hung I'm hungry too, I ain't going to lie. So we are on the road to get us some, see it with me, Waffle House. <laughs> so we'll see y'all when we get there. I think I'm looking crazy when I put my camera out, but like you and Julian and everybody else, it's like a normal thing. So y'all don't even want to be. It is normal. Watch the gold. This is done. Now we at Walmart because I need an SD card. I'm trying to get some footage off of this um, GoPro so I can post it on TikTok and stuff. So I need to pick up. Um, I need to pick up an SD card. I have well, I have one at home, but I don't know where it's at. Huh? Okay. Hopefully they're not an arm and a leg. Let's see. What? Hot cocoa. I wonder if they got the flavor that you like here. What an outlet they got it. Let's see. He looking for what it is, a strawberry shortcake? Oreos. They got, it. They got pumpkin, pumpkin spice. spice. Of course they gonna have it. They got pumpkin spice and toffee crunch. Perfect. I never seen that one or two on. Yeah, this is why my Black Friday sale. They got the little charger cords for six dollars. The little video doorbell thing for forty nine dollars. The um projectors for $29. That's a charging bank, I think. Yep. Dual. It's a dual charging bank. $15. For $15. Okay, Walmart. We see y'all or whatever. Oh, they got all the uh Christmas stuff. Roku. Oh, what is that? That's a camera? Indoor camera, Roku. A Roku camera for $18. Indoor camera. Oh, I don't want no indoor camera. Nope. I need a outdoor camera. Let me see. 
Oh, they got a speaker, a JBL speaker for $89. That's a shame how they be uh, selling these power banks by themselves. These $8. That's the adapter. <laughs> yeah. Well, that was the bus. They didn't have what I needed. They had what I needed, but not for my phone. They had it for like my honey and my mama phone, but not mine. So <sighs> I just have to wait until I get home. So upload footage. I'm sorry. I was trying to get the stuff uploaded uploaded on um I was trying to get the stuff uploaded on TikTok, but I can't. I probably could have had a, a video uploaded for um YouTube for y'all too, but Oh well. Maybe if I can get to somebody's computer, I can do it. I don't know. So are we just gonna, which one are we gonna take? Let's go ahead. Hey y'all. We gonna win this day. <laughs> Amari, Welcome to my channel. <laughs> Life with Darian, and today, and today we went. Oh, today we're gonna be Mom making TikTok. Hold it. Hold it. Let him hold it. Let him hold it. Let him hold it. You gotta just look at it. And he's oh, feeling bad right now. Say hello. 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 Mirror right there. You don't hold the thing. No, that's that. Come in, Ashley. Huh? Come It is day three. It's day three of us in Louisiana. I'm going to say it again. Y'all can say it with me. On the passenger side of my husband. <laughs> um, last, Yesterday, I think the last time y'all seen me was probably when we were on our way to my auntie and my cousin's house and I never picked y'all up after that. Anyway, we um ended up, oh no, 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 no. The last time I seen y'all, we was at Waffle House. So we went to Waffle House. We went um back to my cousin's house. We watched the Miami Dolphins. When? Period. <laughs> and then after that, we um, went and spent some time with my dad and we called it a night. So today is the next day. And we went over to my aunt's house. We had breakfast. Um, the family was playing dominoes. Y'all know we can't go nowhere without playing dominoes, especially when my mom's fiance is there. But right now, baby, and I are on the road. We are headed to get us some daiquiris, period. So I wanted to pick up the camera, say hey, say hi, let y'all know what we had going on. And I'll see y'all in a minute. Daiquiri secured. Hey y'all, don't really know where we left off. However, I'm back home. Obviously, I'm back on the clock. Y'all, we had an amazing time with the family on this past weekend. We really enjoyed ourselves. Yesterday, it was kind of sort of busy. Not really. We woke up at about um, 1 30 in the morning got our things together got on the roll at about two o'clock um made it to drop off our rental car at like three ish it was a little past three i think we got to the airport about 3 20 3 25 something like that by the time we got through security and stuff like that y'all we was boarding within let me see within probably 20 minutes our flight left at 6.30. We got up at 1.30 in the morning. Got on the road at 2. So that's how congested the doggone airport was. And I'm so glad um, I decided for us to leave at the time that we left. Because I never knew the airport get crazy like that. But when we went to Louisiana for my niece's graduation, that taught me a lesson. Because I feel like we almost missed our flight at that time. So I was like, you know what? We're not going to do that again. We're just going to wake up super duper early and just head to the airport. I'd rather wait versus missing a flight. So that's that. Um, got home yesterday and your girl went to sleep. I went to sleep, y'all. Um, coming home, 
from Louisiana yesterday. I felt like like something foreign is in my body, if that makes sense. Like I'm not 100% sick, but I can tell like my body feeling a little funny, like something wants to, you know, happen if that makes sense as far as me like getting a flu or something like my throat feel like it want to hurt or whatever. And yesterday when I was in the bed, I felt like weak or whatever. So my husband started to nurse me back to health. He gave me some third flu last night. I took some um, this morning and then when I get off from work today, I'll take some again. Um, and then after I finish my clients, because I have two clients today, I am going to take some more NyQuil, not NyQuil, some more Theraflu night time, and then I'm going to get my butt in the bed. I don't like to be sick. I have to work all week. This job, I also have to do PR all week, um, not including Friday. So yeah, I, your girl is busy. Your girl is busy. I have things to do, y'all. I have some exciting news for you guys. I have some exciting news for you guys, but I'm going to hold that until everything like goes through, and then I'll announce the good news. That's that on that. Um, your girl is going to do vlogmas. I'm going to try to be consistent and do vlogmas, cause vlogmas. Because Vlogmas is my thing. I love Vlogmas. And I feel like if you are a up and coming YouTuber like myself. I feel like you should do Vlogmas. Because Vlogmas is where it's at. Like if you get into one of these like groups. If that makes sense. Like Facebook groups or what have you. And you are doing Vlogmas. You can you know promote yourself. And then once you start watching other people, if that makes sense, like networking with other YouTubers and they come, you know, to your channel or whatever and start watching you and supporting you, I'm telling you, your following is just gonna, don't take my word for it, try it yourself with that being said. I thank you guys so, so much for always rocking with your girl. If you like this video, please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. It helps me a lot. I feel like it pushes my video, if that makes sense, into the algorithm. I know I can be better when it comes to my consistency. If you're not subscribed, please go ahead and consider subscribing. We are lit here. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.